hi guys welcome back to my channel today i want to show you my first ever sweet kawaii design package i decided to pull the trigger and order a whole bunch of kits well i say a whole bunch but it was like four <laughs> i guess that's more than a bunch right i ordered um things that i think it's gonna fit with my jibun techo i am if you haven't watched that video i am going to uh, move forward and redate my 2023 Jibun Tetro because I did not use it last year and this year we're using everything we got because why not um, so I'm redating uh, 2023 Jibun Tetro A5 Slim and I kind of figured out the measurements um, and Sweet Kawaii the Science is one of the sticker shops that comes the closest to fitting. Um, so I'm hoping that it all works out. Um, if not, it's the year of using all the washi I have. So in a way, that will help. But I do have a lot of stickers. Um, so we'll see. I ordered from the $2 Tuesdays. I did a promo for oopsies so if you spend $25 they also sent you a grab bag and then like I said I ordered itty bitty stuff and then I also ordered um monthlies I think itty bitty so let me show you what I got we'll leave this to the side um so this is the holiday freebie and it's just like create, nourish, audiobooks, music, rest your mind, digital detox, enjoy a treat. This is their new character. I actually don't know their characters very well, so I don't know the name of this one, but I know um, it's new. And then journal, super cute. Then we have another freebie, which was this one. I guess this is the monthly freebie. Oh my God, I love that keyboard. So, this is also a good thing uh, for you to test out the inks, but they do tell you here what would work with their um, paper, because it's vinyl. Yeah, no, I'm totally fine. This is funny. So that's the other freebie. This is their journaling card. This is this guy, the little um, Jetty. I don't know their names, forgive me, but that's what that is and that's sweet kawaii social i don't have a promo code with them or anything like that but if i have a referral code i, I will attach it in the description below so what i went ahead and did i order 80 bd monthly so i ordered january and february uh for my jibun um i think this is gonna work perfectly actually there is a slight chance that they might be slightly big, but the days of the week seem to be okay. So the kits are three pages. So there's the washi strip and then thin washi, days of the week, the 30 days or 31 days. And these are Hoko mugs with like little whipped cream on top, some flags. Then there's some boxes here super adorable and then all these holidays that happen in january i don't know that i will use these because i typically don't track that type of day um temperate oh so they give you a holiday for each day of the month that's awesome croissant day my grandson's favorite day and then um then you have list makers some icons payday script i like that i think this is gonna fit perfectly for what i intend to use it um in all honesty my monthly for my jibun is gonna go very simple um so this is probably gonna be enough but they don't sell the sheet by itself so you have to buy like the whole kit uh which is fine because at the end of the day i can probably make a kit out of this so a weekly out of that i should say so let's take a look at the february february is pretty much the same oh my god look at that i don't know her name i which one's connie i think this might be connie i don't know but anyway super adorable super adorable so here you have the thick washi 
the thin washi and then the days of the week and then for the day dots they put locks heart locks so cute page number two has all the holidays for february umbrella day pizza day tortellini day wow rack day random act of kindness day that's a nice one and there's the boxes and then list makers some headers some quarter boxes and some icons with payday script i love that they give you uh, five paydays in case you get paid weekly um you have enough to cover that um i get paid uh, bi-weekly so i have more than enough so then I order these Edie Beedy Unicorn Dreams and Edie Beedy Penguins. This is perfect because you see the theme going on here. I can use these for for whatever I didn't use um, from the monthly kit. I can use here. And here we have um, headers or quarter boxes. And then list makers, the weekend banner, cute little icons. I love that the payday is like a little like bill. And then here's some um, decor, full boxes, $2 Tuesday, freebie Friday, some script, more boxes, some happy trackers, which I probably won't use, large deco. I think this is going to work perfectly. The stitch boxes and half boxes and quarter boxes more washi the days of the week that i know for a fact uh fit where i want to place them and then like these are look how tiny they are so i think these kits are gonna work wonders for me so this i can probably do the whole month of january with that like that so that makes me happy this one i ordered because i couldn't help myself right Super adorable. This is the Itty Bitty Unicorn Dreams. So here's the list makers, the headers or quarter boxes, some icons. And this one has this cute little unicorn, which I thought it was super cute. I think these uh, look a little bit different. Yeah, see, I think it's because... Um, depending when they were released, the layouts were different. Because, see, this has $2 Tuesday and Freebie Friday. Oh, I guess they're here, too. But these are banners. And then, oh, my God, so adorable. Boxes, the washi. Yeah, I couldn't pass this up. This was too freaking cute for me not to have that. So I can probably uh, merge some of these components into the leftovers of that. So that's great. And then let's open this oopsie bag. Um, this is a freebie. Uh, you have to enter the oopsie code to get it if you place an order of $25, which I did. And let's see. It says we might not be perfect, but we still need a good home. So let's go with the big ones. So we have stitch boxes. So we have stitch boxes in Valentine theme colors. Oh my god, I've been wanting one of these. We're better together. And this is one of those big stickers. And I think this is just the imperfection there. Super cute. I don't know what the imperfection is here. I think these are fine. Um, oh my god, they're all dressed as uh, pumpkins and squash. So cute. All the little critters. And then the space ones. <laughs> so cute. Look at that shooting star. And then work out. What a hint. What a hint that I need to work out. It is what it is. January started, you guys. So might as well start jumping into that bang wagon of getting healthy all over again. Or actually picking up the habits that I had already set for myself. And I literally take a break from because you know the holidays uh, but i hope you're having a beautiful day and i'll see you on the next video bye hi guys welcome back today we're gonna open a package from um sarah marie stickers 
I placed this order um, while she was having her anniversary shop anniversary. She did like five days of shop anniversary savings. I think this was day four or five. I don't remember. Um, and this one essentially was for reduced price on her grab bags. And you guys know I love her grab bags. Um, but I also placed orders uh, for a customs and the custom orders on top. Um, I want to show you what it is. Essentially, I'm going really basic with my budget planning, quote unquote, or budgeting, I should say. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this paycheck one, paycheck two, um, to just notate my paychecks and then do the breakdown right below it so I can actually set up my, um, my budget planner now. Um, I was kind of waiting for these low key. So I got these. Um, I love this size. Aside from it, um, I wasn't sure if she was going to do a number or just do uh, one and two, but she did the numbers. I would have preferred that it had the actual script, but it's okay. I still use them. I still like them. And then this is her information, Sarah Marie on YouTube, Instagram and Facebook, Sarah Marie stickers. I watch her. Um, I watch her when she releases a new video, um, which I love watching. Um, so I highly recommend her channel. Here's the December freebies, just a whole bunch of black and white icons. This is an Etsy shop. She does not have a website or anything like that. And now one of the changes she implemented in her shop is, I don't know if you guys know, but a lot of the Etsy shops now are promoting themselves, themselves with a direct link to their shop. And that is because it helps them save money on fees. Um, she is one of those where she's actually now promoting everything with her actual um, Etsy link. And now in order for you to get any type of freebies for the month, um, you will need to shop through that link, uh, which I think is super smart. I think that anytime you can save money and, you know, I think it's super smart and that's how I have that. I shop her direct link. Um, she posted um, on her Facebook group and she also has it linked, I believe, on her, um, what do you call it, Instagram profile. Um, but yeah, so let's get to the grab bag because I'm looking at these and I'm just like, yes. So I got this. Um, I think this is like a daily duo um, situation because... It has the thick washi. Oh, she sent me the whole kit. Wow, this is the whole kit. Okay. So this is a fall theme um, kit, MK109. It has thick washi, some headers. It feels like this is like for the daily duo. Days of the week, day dots. These day dots are perfect for my G-Boon. And these um, boxes and list makers. So from that, in the same kit, we also have this one, which is just all the quarter, half, no, all quarter boxes, all types of boxes, which is great because they're in neutral colors and I love that. Then we have the monthly. I think this is, oh, eight by five coil. This might work for my j -Boon. I might have to trim it a bit. Um, and work out a different system for days of the week. I might just cover that and or just cut it, you know, I don't know, we'll see. And then there's the day dots, perfect, perfect. I'm loving this. Oh, this is perfect. Then here we have like headers and then boxes. I probably won't use that in that planner, but I can definitely use these. And then we have, I don't see anything wrong with them. I think there's just like printing marks here, but um, other than that, so far so good. Then it's the following sheet. It's again, the check boxes for list making, headers, boxes. I feel like these are for Diggly Duo because they're big. Jeez, I think it's everything in that release or MK109. So there's Autumn Deco, super cute. Then we have more list makers. 
Oh, these are so cute. I can totally use these. And then here's more. Another set of half and quarter boxes decorated. More. More. Oh, the script is so cute. And then here's the script. Super cute. Then list makers. Ah, if I can get it out. There we go. Cute. I love this tone. I really do. And then there's icons here. I think these are all add-ons. Super cute. Then we have one, two, three, and four date covers and date dots. I love it. My God, this is awesome. Then here's all the washi. So thin strips, thick washi. Then we have boxes, full boxes. Oh, this pattern is freaking cute. And I think it's because it's so light, my camera's having issues showing it to you, but it's adorable. Then here's the 8x5 dashboard for the Erin Condren. So cute. Super, super cute. Then we have the sampler, which I really like. I think this will also work in my Jibun, I'm hoping. What does that say? Oh, Sarah Marie sticker order. I don't know what the heck is wrong with my focus, but it's so cute. Then we have larger script. This is, I guess, something you can use for, um, for what? For the headers here. So you can use that or you can just move them somewhere else. And then this is for the seven by nine planner which I probably won't use because I don't have 7x9. I think I'm, I don't want to say retired, but I think I'm just done with 7x9. It's a great size, but I think I'm used to the small planners now. And then here's another monthly. This is relatively bigger than the previous one. So I want to say if that's for like an 8x10. Yeah. Oh, or 7x9. One or the other. More washi more washi and then more washi so it's a whole kit i don't even want to say it's a whole kit it's just literally everything in that collection um which is perfectly fine because i'm all set for september for all my planners <laughs> um so this is awesome i love it i hope you guys are having a beautiful day and i'll see you on the next one bye Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we have packages. The packages that I got, uh, it's an order for Jet Pens. Uh, yes, I did cheat uh, on Atlas with Jet Pens, but that's only because uh, Atlas didn't have this item. I got a little gift from a um, friend, and then I have a huge haul from Stationery Pal. I haven't ordered from them in a long time, and I don't know what happened, but I think I ordered like 20 gazillion things. So let me show you that first because I am very curious to see how this package arrived. Because it came in about a week and a half from me ordering it. Uh, Stationery Pal is located, I believe, in China somewhere. I am not 100% sure, but it's in Asia. So it does some take some time to get here. So... This is a cute box that they sent. And it says Stationery Pal with this cute rainbow bear. Oh, jeez. It says, thank you, Barry and Frank Canna Vibes. I love their bubble wrap, guys, because their bubble wrap has little hearts on it. I don't know if you can make that out, but yeah. Super, super cute. And this is like a Pikachu style bunny. It says Stationery Pal and oh, cute i didn't order this they sent me this one this is so freaking cute and it feels super super soft and i just see that it's kind of ripped there but i can just sew it on there and then maybe put a magnet in there and put it on my fridge i think that's what i will do so 
let me see how we can do this okay so let's put this little guy over here because he's adorable and you know we love all this confetti that they send us and honestly i reuse all that stuff so that works so i ordered um white matte white washi i use this to cover up dates i'm currently in the process of redating um a tetro for 2023 so i think i'm gonna be using a lot of that so i decided to order an extra one i already have one already started in a new one and then i ordered this cute little leaf style washi i thought it was cute i was there it's that late night shopping you guys that gets you um they sent a card and the card is just says thank you for shopping with us and then what did i order okay this no surprise to anyone i ordered ralph breaks the internet princess um mystery boxes i'm kind of worried because this is ariel in the front but these are supposed to be pop mark mystery boxes and these are the possibilities vanellope being the chaser i don't know any of these from this collection and of course i would prefer to get jasmine and moana out of this collection but i don't even see moana on here i just see jasmine and i will need um vanellope yeah, I don't collect any other other princesses. So I ordered two of those from them. Um, they did do, um, they did give me a discount code. Um, so I was able to order them and get them cheaper than I normally would have. Then I ordered this phone case, which I will let you guys know if it fits my phone. I thought it was cute. And I was like, why not? Again, midnight, late night shopping got me. I ordered these cute clips for my planner. Although I'm realizing that like my Jibun Tetro lies completely flat, like a flat piece of paper. So I think I'm gonna use these for my A6. So I ordered two of those, but I had these in my cart. I've been trying to stay away from these because I've seen them in other people's pics and I think they're adorable, but the midnight shopping. So I ordered those, right? Where are we? I ordered these and this one came undone. And these are glue pens. From what I read on there, they were glue pens. So essentially, oh, the spring fell off this one. So essentially, um, you write on it and it's glue, like a pen. So I order one for my cousin and one for myself. I have to find the little string. It's probably in here somewhere. So I order two of those. Then I also order these jet, no, gel ink ball pens. My daughter asked me uh, for these, but these are, I don't think are the ones that I ordered because I ordered the ones from Energel. Um, I have to look at the receipt that I got to make sure these are the right ones. But I ordered these because my daughter asked me for Klena pens, and that's what I thought I had ordered. Um, this might be a freebie because I didn't remember ordering this campus marker. It has the fine tip, and then on the other side it has the bold or felt tip in gray. I always use these. Why do I feel like I had to order more? Then I ordered these fun things. They're DIY diamond paintings. I love diamond pen paintings. I have a lot of them. Some of them I have started and some of them that are new. But essentially these are cute little ones that are stickers. So I order a few Sanrio style ones. They come um, with the gems already. And you know the sorter and the wax and the thing. So I think it was a very complete kit. So I order this one, I order Kuromi, and then my Melody. And I think in a previous video, I told you that Kuromi was Hello Kitty's like goth, um, I don't know, goth cousin, sister side. 
it's not it's actually my melodies <laughs> so I wanted to correct myself on that so I go order them um, I think I'm gonna share these with one of my daughters who's really into uh, diamond painting so I might share that with her so this is all I got with the stationary pals then let's take a look at jet pens this tiny little package you guys like literally it's not that big went all over the country but my house this was a package um, that was sent a day after i ordered and like i said the package went everywhere but here mind you this company is only 45 minutes away from me so if anything so it was like sometimes i get these packages within a day so i was very sad the, um, to see that these went everywhere but where I needed them to go. I order a rounded food a nib in the 0.5 from Jet Pens. I'm not sure um, if you guys follow calligraphy slash fountain pen ink uh, content on Instagram. You will find that there's an account that um, ink swatched all of the ink vent calendar inks in this nib and I really like how it looked. So I order these nibs. I already have the holder. Um, and while I was on the site, I came across this glass uh, pen. So I thought it was super cute. Then I realized that it's a pen. Like literally they have a body of a pen with the cap that's customizable. You can pick the color of the cap that you want. You put it on there and you can treat it like a fountain Oh, I'm over here screwing it. I'm like, oh my God, did I order the wrong thing? Um, but essentially, um, this is what it is. So I thought it was super cute. I can actually store this in my pen pouch that I just got from Atlas. Uh, they do have a fountain pen nib available and the cartridges for it. When you're doing the glass pen, that's not something that's available for it because you have to dip um, the tip into the ink, you know. So I thought this was super cute, something that I can keep in my repertoire, especially when swatching inks. I think that's just something you should have um, just ready. Um, now, this is the package that looks like it's been through the ringer and back from my friend Isa or Marisabel, I should say, and she sent me some stuff. I want to share with you what she sent me. I know she was sending me one thing, but I don't know what else she sent me. She sent, she told me she was sending me some other stuff for someone special at Thanksgiving. She's so cute. I love her. I hanged out with her. Um, not too long ago it's like a whole bunch of like little sticky notes and stuff so i know this was coming which is sweet bean plants winter kit and the deco the boxes the days of the week and she sent me cute little tcmc samples and stickies some of these she makes herself from the printables so like legit um, I love getting stuff like this from her because it's super cute and you can use it um, to send other packages and stuff like that. I see a note in there, so I'm going to leave that in there so I can read it. Love that. I have to send her a message to let, you know I, to let her know I received it. But this is the first haul of the year, you guys. I hope you guys had a wonderful beginning to the year that you have already put away your Christmas decorations because I just did that um, yesterday. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we have mail from The Giving Girl. I took it out of the plastic envelope it arrives in because it had my information. You guys know how much I love this packaging. I've shown this to you plenty, plenty of times. Super cute, super adorable. I love it. I actually uh, use it to recycle some things I sent out the other day. So perfect. Anyways, I shop with The Giving Girl for $2 Tuesday. She had some cute, cute things uh, this particular um, Dollar Tuesday. 
I think this was a Dollar Tuesday in the first week of January, I think. Or, yeah, the first week of January or the last week of December. I don't remember which. Um, but let me show you what I got. I got some duplicates to give to my cousin also. So we got the Facebook freebie, which is this one. And this is an all order freebie. I love this. Look at that pretty girl. Then I ordered this cute one. Um, I think you can use this for New Year's or for birthday, whatever you prefer. I think I'm going to use it for my birthday. So I have that springtime pansy palette. I just love the colors. The colors are so beautiful and so brilliant. I got some bows because it seems like that's the thing right now. And I actually got two, one for me and one for my cousin, Make Up Your Plan. And then I ordered this other pansy motif and pansies in full bloom. So one, two, three, four. And then I also ordered mini calendars. So here's the thing. I have a Hobonichi Weeks that I am redating from 2023 to 2024. I had ordered Helen's, the Coffee Monsters Co's calendars, right? But it turns out that the calendars are actually too big for the purpose intended. Um, I'm not using them like they're supposed to be used. That's another thing. But I saw that the Giving Girl had these mini ones. Um, and then, although I'm not into a Sunday start kind of person, I said this probably would work because these are actually on, um, what do they call this? Um, matte paper, I think. <sighs> Can't think. Anyways, they're white background, right? So I think these will work for the function I intend to give them. So I'm going to show you that planner pretty soon here. Um, so you guys can see how I'm using that particular planner and how I'm redating it, which redating is really not much of a science per se, but it can take a lot of work, which is fine with me because I have a lot of date dots and days of the week. So that kind of works out a bit for me. So I'm hoping to reduce my stash when it comes to that kind of stuff a lot. Um, and I do have a lot of Hobonichi Weeks kits um, that I'm going to be using. So I have everything sorted out for each planner that I'm using, which is kind of funny that I'm doing that because I have a section of my secrets for journaling only, and then the other ones, well, not for journaling only, but you know, when I journal, this is what I'm going to pull out. When I plan for my week, this is what I'm going to pull out. When I do my budget, this is what I pull out, and so on and so forth. So... I hope you guys are having a beautiful day, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye. Let me take that. Oh, God. This is so beautiful. So freaking beautiful.